Hey, what's up guys? So in this video, I'm going to talk about some of the generative AI features that One UI 6.1.1 has brought with it. So I've recently received this update on my Galaxy S24 Ultra and with it, I've got all these new features. So let's go ahead and take a look at some of these amazing features and what you can do with it. Now, there are a couple of features that you will access through the gallery app on your phone. So let's go into the gallery app. So here you can see that I've got my own photo here and if I tap on this AI button it will take me to this editing mode and here the first feature is portrait studio. If I tap on it it will detect my face and then below that you can see that we have some categories like comic, 3D cartoon, watercolor and sketch. Now you can go on all of these categories and it will convert your image to that style. So if I select comic and tap on generate it will generate comic um, images and it will give us few examples as well so there you go then next one is 3d cartoon and it does a pretty good job because the images that it creates uh, look like you uh, pretty much so here you can also uh, see that not all the images have headphones just that one image have headphone on it so it's not detecting the headphone now the next category is watercolor so here are some of the examples of watercolor and finally the last one is sketch and there you go these are the results for the sketch and then you can save these and you can discard these if you want now if i tap on this ai button you will see the next feature which is sketch to image and here you can actually uh, make changes to your pre-existing photos so for example here i've got this image here and i would really like to draw and add mountains to this image and i'm going to draw some mountains in this scene and then just tap generate And there you go we've now got mountains in this and it does a pretty good job of blending the mountains with the hills and i think this one is pretty good and if i select uh, this one and zoom on it you'll see that the blending is amazing now i'm gonna do it again and i want to add some snow to these mountains as well so i'm just gonna do some white dotting on the mountains and i also want to um generate a river from the mountains downstream now let's see what it does tap on generate and there you go these are the results it's not perfect we don't see any rivers here but um, you know, it's not perfect. We've got some white colored trees here. That was not the intended purpose, but that's what it thought. So there are mixed examples here, but I think this one is um, pretty close to what I was going for. Now we have a long mountain range here with some snow on the mountains as well. And it blends pretty well with the whole scene. So I really like this one. So there you go. That's the two things that you can do in the gallery app. Now the next one is sketch to image. And you can access it through your S Pen. So if I tap on it, it opens up this canvas and here you can draw anything. I'm going to draw a table and a monitor on the table and basically a desk setup here. So let's add some speakers. Monitor is there and there is some scenery going on the monitor. I'm going to add a window on the side. So to give it a more realistic look and some paintings on the wall so now i'm going to select 3d cartoon here tap on generate and wait for it to generate us a 3d cartoon images and there you go guys and that actually looks pretty cool we have all the elements covered we have a desk set up here monitor with speakers uh, some photos on the wall and the window on the side and it looks pretty great it's not perfect but it does the job of what you were intending to do now you can change the category from here let's go in pop art and generate that so there you go now we have some pop art examples next one is sketch 
and there we have some sketch examples and it's pretty nice next one let's go with illustration once again pretty nice and does a great job and finally we have watercolor so let's take a look at that as well so that's um, some watercolor examples and it does a great job you can then tap on this three dot menu you can change the transparency of this whole canvas so you can see uh, your phone screens as well and you can actually keep it in the middle as well to see the context of where you are at in your phone which home screen or app drawer which app you're using you can also minimize it move the canvas around and do your work and then just tap on it to bring it back and then start working on it again you can also copy it and go in settings from where you can learn more about this drawing assist feature now you can access it through the pen section as well as the edge panels and in case if you don't have an s pen you can also use your fingers to draw and use this feature now the last generative ai feature is in samsung notes so open the notes go in a new note and here just draw anything with your s pen i'm going to draw a car here so let's draw some of the elements of the car steering wheel the driver and the car is moving door handle now let's give it some realistic elements draw the road and now i want to draw some mountains because this is a picturesque environment where this guy is driving his car so and the sun is shining down as well so that's a pretty rough sketch now we have this uh, ai button here tap on it and then tap on sketch to image now it asks you to draw around the image that you want um, to draw so you will select the image and then once again you can select from these categories select the category tap on generate and it will convert your rough sketch into a beautiful piece of art so there you go once again it looks pretty nice pretty cool we have a car road and mountains and you can see all the elements this is great and i'm really liking this feature and there are a lot of applications to this if you're taking notes you want to draw something you can just draw a rough sketch of it and then use this feature to generate a beautiful art through it so you get the gist this is how it works and then let's go in illustration And the illustration is pretty good as well so this is really fun you know you can use it for fun you can use it for work there are a lot of applications to this especially in this notes app so that's the last style watercolor once again it does a pretty good job and then you can tap on add to note to add it to your note and then you have your sketch at the top and then you have the ai generated image at the bottom you can then also tap on this three dot menu and save it to your gallery.